Hello there everybody, Number Eve here, and today is the one year anniversary of one of my unfunny ongoing gags on this channel that'll probably never die. I'm of course talking about Number Blue was wrong. The video was a funny attempt at proving Number Blue wrong, which in all honesty it was just a sarcastic mess. The reason for me making Number Blue was wrong was because Number Blue made a correcting video on top 5 ways to improve YouTube which is my video. So, because YouTube drama, I made a video on his video, which was about my video. That's how drama works on YouTube, kids. So, wh what are we doing now? Well, today, my friends, we are going to correct Number Blue is Wrong, which is a video about me correcting Zach when Zach is correcting my original video. Trust me, this, this won't get confusing. So before we get started, click up here to watch the playlist and get refreshed on what has happened. Because I'm not going to be correcting the entirety of Number Blue was wrong, just the parts where it's me talking. You know, because we've already corrected everything else about every single situation in that video. So click up there to get a refresher, you know, and just and just figure out what in the world is going on. Is, has Master Eath gone insane? Probably, but that has nothing to do with this video. Warning, this is a super sarcastic video. If you hate sarcasm or just can't take a joke, please leave now, thank you. Right off the bat, I realized that I shouldn't have added this part to begin with because it basically ruins the entire video. Not every single thing I say in the video is sarcastic, if you can believe that. So how are people supposed to know what information is sarcastic and which isn't? Like the scene, for example. My videos are perfect in every possible way. Way. See, that, that that was obvious sarcasm, but this... I don't just put out content that I just make and then don't fix later because I'm lazy. See, I understand that Pastif doesn't want hate for his corrections, so he just added something at the beginning of the video that was like, dude, I'm being sarcastic, so if I'm wrong, that's obviously why. So, we're gonna react to his video, and no, I'm not gonna react to his video. <laughs> <laughs> so what just happened <laughs> was that I say something and then I immediately contradict myself and I don't even cut out the part that I said originally that I didn't even mean. Great, great editing there. I'm gonna point out all the flaws in all of his arguments. Sure, you'll point out the flaws in Zach's argument, but it doesn't really discredit Zach's opinion as, as we later find in the video. And yes, I'm holding this mic because I don't have a stand right here. This would be awesome if I had a stand right here. <laughs> J J Jealous past Steve? What I'm saying is if there was a star there, smaller YouTubers like me will be noticed more. Um, we, we, we still don't have the star for us smaller YouTubers. I mean, big channels that have 100,000 subscribers have a verification badge. Do we get a badge? No, we don't have 100,000 subscribers yet. Also, Number Blue states that if a channel creates content, it should be a certain colored name. To be honest, currently, I actually agree with that. I think that's a great idea. And that box thing is just an extra feature. I'm not saying one or the other. Adding the, just the boxes would be stupid. I'm kind of eh about the whole box thing now, actually. It, it actually was kind of stupid the, the more I actually thought about it. Yes, you're right. Adding just the boxes would be pretty stupid. But considering the fact that there are some channels out there that don't post for months, you know, it's not really fair to them, especially when their content is really good, which is another- th Yes, that's another thing Number Blue said, I, I'm fully aware. And he said that you should change the channel names to colors. No! No, no! You're not thinking about the colorblind people, Number Blue. This was obviously an attempt to be funny that obviously didn't work. See, he even agrees that I'm right, meaning my video is 100% perfect and right in every way possible. Yo, back at it again with the sarcasm! G gosh, this video has a lot of sarcasm. Listen, get, get off your high horse, man. You have no clue that you're gonna be me in a year. So, don't be too proud. And, you know what? Number Blue isn't that bad of a guy- Actually, no, I don't wanna say that. Greg, can you cut that out? Let me- let me ask you a question. Did you even watch your own videos? Greg obviously didn't cut that part out. You can't tell me that you didn't mean to do that on purpose. Because if you did, 
That was a really lame joke. He's just restating it in a way to make it look like he's more important than everybody else. One. That was easy sarcasm. I, I actually appreciate that. Two, nobody is more important than anybody else. We're all humans. I have more subscribers, making me more important as a person, an individual, and as a YouTuber. See, 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 Pastif is basically drunk with power at this point. He thinks that just because your numbers are bigger, that means you're more important than number blue, which is ridiculous. The point is, I have 60 subscribers now. I'm popular. Wait, wait, wait. 60 subscribers. <laughs> Hashtag small, small YouTube probs, am I right? Views don't matter, it's watch time. Oh, I noticed, Pastif. I noticed that the video is 10 minutes long. Okay, you, you didn't have to tell me. I knew exactly what you were doing. Wanna know why? Because I was you one year ago. Terrible camera production quality, ETH. I gotta get the watch time up. So that way people, I don't know, l watch my videos more. No, 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 Pasty, that's that's not how this works. See, there's this thing called audience retention, meaning that there's only a few select people that actually watch your entire video. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me right now, Number Blue? Seriously, it's called comedy. Oh yes, I forgot about that. The whole, it's just a joke, man. That's a stupid argument. You used this to cover up the fact that the way you structured one of your points was extremely flawed. And to my knowledge, only you understood that joke. So it, it's not funny to anybody else. What's the point of making a list video or a five ways to whatever video if you're not gonna make it somewhat funny? Gee, I don't know. It's not like you can just inform someone about something without being funny. Hmm, it's not like there are YouTube channels out there dedicated to informing people. Last two points are supposed to be funny. That doesn't excuse the terrible point. Okay, may maybe the points themselves weren't terrible, but the way you structured it was flawed. Because if you watch till the end of the video, it's like, okay, great, I guess I watched that video. That is an accurate description of all of my videos. So, laugh, please. Please. Oh gosh, this is worse than begging for likes. Listen, Pasty, you're not funny. Stop trying to be funny. Well, you're two minutes. Do I really need to explain this point? It's just another stupid joke. Let's let's move on. Wait, that didn't make sense. Greg, make sure to cut that out. Thank you. Like I said before, you really don't watch your own videos, do you? Greg obviously didn't cut that part out. Yes, more comedy. Ha ha, laugh, funniness. See, okay, see, you gotta make it funny. You, you said this before. I said this before. Tassif then starts repeating the same point as his last point, saying, Oh, it's just comedy, man! And Number Blue apparently doesn't care. If Number Blue didn't care, he wouldn't be making a video about you. It's sad to think that we live in a world where you can just make a reaction video and you think that you're not gonna hurt anybody else's feelings, but you really do hurt other people's feelings inside. I mean, yeah, but you're playing the victim card very heavily here. So what if people don't like your video? Not everybody's gonna like your video. The reason I do this channel is to entertain people, make them laugh, make their day. To be real, that, that still hasn't changed, honestly. I really do enjoy making videos, and I'm glad that people like what I make. It's good to know that some of you really enjoy my videos, and that makes me really happy. I, I really thank you for that. If we can learn anything from this video, it's that people's opinions change over a certain span of time. It's quite interesting to see how my physical appearance has changed, you know, personal opinions, terrible camera quality. It's kind of weird to see me from a year ago again, you know, I have changed. And I hope that's for the better. Congratulations, you're one of the 38% of people to click on this video to actually watch all the way through. Thank you! If you're new, subscribe and press that bell. I also have a Patreon, which is only in the description. I wish I could put it on screen, but I, YouTube won't let me. So, thank you for watching, and I will see you 
next time.